and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Actually, it is one. <laughs> we are today. I will read five chapter. Abraham sacrificed Isaac. Abraham obeyed God. Abraham worshipped God. He prayed to God. He wanted to please God. Abraham was God's friend. So, Abraham was God's friend. He loved God and obeyed Him. And he also pleased him. One day, God told Abraham, Put your son Isaac on the altar. Scott said, He will die there. Actually, Abraham got his son Isaac uh, when he was 100 years old. Like he, so Isaac is like so more important important thing to Abraham and Sarah. But like suddenly God has gave Isaac and now God is saying to sacrifice him. Abraham will very like think about that. I think. If I am Abraham, maybe I will also disobey God because like I have to like sacrifice my son. If I am Abraham, Abraham was very sad. He didn't, did not want his son to die, but God said he must to do it. He must do this. What should Abraham do? What should Abraham do? I last seen the next page, like. When he was hundred years old, like they had, didn't have a baby, but like when they were hundred years old, like they had, had a son, Isaac. But like now, God is saying to sacrifice him. Abraham knew what he must do. He must obey God. So Abraham put Isaac to a, on an altar. So, Abraham knew he must trust God. So he said to Ab Is so he said so Abraham put Isaac on the altar. But when only Isaac was a boy, like God said, to sacrifice him. But Abraham obeyed God. But God did not let Isaac die. Stop! God said, I do know that one. I don't want. Uh, <laughs> I do not want Isaac to die now. I know what I know that you really obey and trust me. So it was Abraham's big test. Like now he it was a test like and Abraham obeyed him. Like God said to sacrifice his Uh, his favorite son, like his son, first star. Yeah, Abraham obeyed God. We also should obey God. Abraham was very happy. He went home with Isaac. Are you happy that Abraham obeyed God? Yes. Chapter 6, Jacob's Dream Jacob saw the ladder. 
Jacob was very sad. He had to run away from home. He had to go away far. So Jacob has got the blessing and status older brother, older brother, like dad wanted to give the blessing to the old brother, but like dad, Jacob's dad was old, so like he dressed up like his older brother And he have got the blessing now. His older brother knew that, so like he was very angry. Jacob walked all day. He walked far from me home. Then he stopped. It was time to sleep. The bee so big. <laughs> so. Jacob like run away so far because like if like also like his brother was like trying to kill him because he was so angry because like he was going to get the blessing but like already her his younger brother has got the blessing. That night, Jacob saw a dream. He saw a ladder. It went all the up to heaven. Angels went up and down to the ladder. So Jacob had a dream, and in that dream, Jacob saw many angels. With a big ladder, way up to heaven, like angels were. Angels went up and down from the ladder. Then God told to Jacob, "I will go with you." God said, "I will help you." So, like in his dream, God told him that God will help Jacob and he will. Be with Jacob. Also, God is with us now. Also, God like knows everything, and like even what I am doing now. Maybe what my friends are doing. Like He knows everything. Jacob stopped dreaming. He sat up. God were he, God was here. He said, and God will go with me. So now, like after that dream, he knew that God will be with him. Jacob was very happy. He wanted God to go with him. He want God to help him. So Jacob wanted God to be with him. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? The next time I will read another good story. Like and God keeps His promise and God is with us every day and night. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? The next time I will read another good story. Then see you next time. Bye.